Well, David, back to the caregivers now. All new tonight, a call for help. School nurses are being drafted into the fight against coronavirus. And as WBZ Cheryl Fiandaka explains, theirs will be a battle behind the scenes. I certainly will put myself out there. School nurses in Milford say they are willing to step in and volunteer to help hospitals overwhelmed with coronavirus patients. The district has already donated medical supplies. We were able to give them thermometers, uh, gloves, and we also had some um, respirator masks for them as well. With schools closed, nurses are also checking in on students with health issues and offering families support. As a school nurse and, and being in the public health um, field, I think it's important that we continue to um, engage with the community and students and just teaching about, you know, supporting your own immune system, whether that's eating healthy, sleeping, um, getting outside for a little while every day, uh, getting some exercise, trying to keep your stress level down. And in Boston, it's all hands on deck. School nurses are working with the Department of Health, tracing cases in an effort to stop the spread of COVID-19. The tight-knit healthcare community understands the need to help fight the virus and help each other. Any nurse in general, and particularly the school nurses, we are considered to be community health nurses. And while the nurses we spoke to are worried about having the right equipment to stay safe, they also know they're well trained to handle the crisis. Well, I think, you know, we've all been schooled the same way. I mean, the basic caring for patients, the basic precautions that we use are all, you know, we're all comfortable with that. The Massachusetts School Nurses Organization tells us more than 800 of its members are already in the community working. Cheryl Fiandaka, WBZ News.